Oh yeah! Fuck, that hurts so much. Sup, Chick Squad. My name is John Chick Squad. I got this right Twitch channel. Today, we're gonna talk about teachers. Oh, fuck, that hurts. Oh. So, that's, that's a little intro. It hurts. Hurts. Uh, so, there are, to me, there, there are a bunch of teachers, but then there's just five main teachers. And these are five main teachers that I have been through, I have going through right now, and um, I have trouble with. So, without further ado, here's top five teachers that I have met, and most of them I have hated. So, coming at number one. Number one. The lazy teacher. Ah, oh, everybody has to go through a lazy teacher, and if you don't know a lazy teacher, it is him or her that gives wrong information and just grabs anything from the internet and then call it theirs. That's lazy teacher, and they they don't even care if it's it's a right class or not. For example, um, he could be teaching um sex ed while the class is English. For example, um, this right here. Good morning class. Today we're going to talk about the birds and the bees. If you don't know what the birds and the bees is, it's your dad and your mom having you. So, examples are this, spice, and my hand. So your dad, dick, penis, or whatever you guys call it, into your mom's vagina. And then, you just push it in there. First, it may be tight. But then with a little force, it opens like that. And if she do it every month, your mom's vagina will look like this. And so, a couple of months later, they have you. Any questions? Excuse me, sir. When we're going to do drawings? Wait. This is in third form. Oh shit. Sorry kids, go back to your crayons and drawing. So that's that's a lazy teacher. In my opinion, I hate lazy teachers. For um I don't know why I write notes, but since I'm a good student, I just write their notes for no apparent reason. So that I could be writing gibberish, I wouldn't know something I could write being um continue writing math when it's practically Spanish. So that those are lazy teachers, they don't care. If, if they have a cl correct class or not, they don't care if they're in the correct class or anything. So, without further ado, let's, let's, let's go to the second teacher. What's the second teacher? The second teacher. Those teacher who tries to stay hip, or whatever you call it. And, I, I don't know why teachers try to stay hip. That, that, that's that to me. Like, they try to make... Okay, class. So, today, what we're gonna do is, can you please tell me what you're gonna do on the weekends? How about you, Nick? I'm going to chill with my friends. Oh, hang with your friends? You even got friends? Anyone? No one? All detention. Everyone get detention. You think that's bad? That's what we do it every day. That's what I do it every day in a specific subject, but I'm not going to say it. So, that's, that's his second teacher, and that's a teacher who, like, just hurts my mind or hurts my brain and then so that's all I got just second teacher that just uh, just just makes me cringe well just makes other cringe not me because fun fact I can't be cringed I can't get cringed for some apparent reason so what's it what's the third teacher what's the third teacher go on to the th three the SV SV teacher yes the SV teacher and if you don't know what SV teacher stands for it's Sandy Vagina Teacher. Hope I don't get anything about this thing. But it's a Sandy Vagina Teacher. If you don't know a Sandy Vagina Teacher, my, my neighbor's a teacher as well. So I have to say the F quiet. Not they'll probably hear me. And if you're not hearing me, I'm sorry because I'm whispering because my teacher's a neighbor. My, my neighbor's a teacher. And I'm saying teachers are SV. So if you know the SV teachers are, they're teachers that are um, going to fail you no matter what, give you wrong information, 
and just just makes things awkward for no apparent reason so this is a sv t-shirt right here okay class today we're gonna that's true J jamie jamie what the fuck did you just say just now nothing nah i heard you say something say it. I, I just sneezed i didn't hear a sneeze man i heard you say something man up those, those are the type of teachers that I really, really hate. I hate those teachers, to be honest. And so, without, without further ado, let's, let's go into number four. So, what's number four? So, number four is the teachers that make their life, their pers personal life, has to do with your education. So, I call these teachers the personal teachers. And these personal teachers are that something happens in their life and they bring it to school which has nothing to do with no, with um, the subject nor the students just them and they bring it into school so example would be like this Nicole are you cheating? are you cheating? just just like how my, my husband is, is cheating on me because I, 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 I see I see he, he, has, he has a connection right? he has a connection on, on my friend on my best friend and Barbara, but she never says he. She never talked to him. She she always says how she's humble. She's a best friend. But I say screw her, screw her because I've seen I've seen the talk. I've seen their talking. And so if they're talking, they they're getting together. <laughs> they're getting together. <laughs> and and I don't want that to happen. He's a special. He's mine. <sighs> oh oh, you're not cheating. Oh, what's that? Oh, just an empty piece of paper? Oh, my bad. Sorry, kid. And number five is the dope teacher. If you don't know the dope teacher, it's it's she's like Oprah of this of, of, of the class. She's like Oprah of the class and it's so so much fun. Like I love these kind of teacher and I wish we had more of these teachers, but sadly we just have limited hands mode while we have this other other SV and um, lazy um, other teachers but we don't have enough dope teachers so if you don't know what dope teacher is she's this type or he's this type of person right here so class um, today we're gonna talk about math algebra and so can anybody please answer this what's 2 plus 2 yes Nick 4 that's, that's perfect, Nick. Of course it's four. You know what, Nick? Are you failing math? You know what? You're going to pass. You're going to pass. Don't, don't worry about what this teacher said. You're going to pass. Okay. So, does anybody can tell me what's two times two? Jason, you're a fucking genius. You know what? How much How much are you getting in math? Oh, 60? Oh, you're not, you're not supposed to get any 60, man. You're supposed to get any 80s. You know what? I'm going to change that score. Yeah, because you deserve it, man. You deserve it. Can anybody tell me what's 3 times 3? Oh, fuck yeah. You're you're a genius, Nicole. You're a genius. You're going to pass this semester. You know what? Everybody's going to pass. You get 20 points. You get 20 points. You get 20 points at the exam. Yeah, everybody gets 20 points at the exam. Yeah. And if, 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 if you guys could do it, then anyone could do it. Be there. Be strong. Yeah. So that shit is. So there you guys go. That's all for this video. Um, thanks for joining me. That's the top five teachers that I've met, I've um, I've, I've been taught by, and others. And so that's all for this video. Thank you guys for joining. Thank you guys for watching. And I'm gonna hurt that rooster soon. And that's all. So guys, if you're wondering why I just upload mostly Mondays, because one, um, I'm working on a, a tournament, a stop motion tournament, and two, uh, it um, this pig fed this tournament takes most of my time. And if you wanna know what what the tournament about is or what I'm talking about, um, it's practically me and someone or me and my best friend are doing this, and so we're doing a tournament. It's called the G1 Climax Tournament. And the winner gets a briefcase between my show or his show. And so that's how we do it. And guys, that rooster uh, triggered. Triggered. So there you guys have it, guys. 
thank you for joining me. Um, Friday, I know I'm not uploading a JLG episode, but I'm gonna find a way. And if guys, if I hit 500,000 subscribers, ah, I've gotta hurt a chicken. I am going to upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. Three videos in a week, and guys, <sighs> triggered. So, there you guys have it. Thanks for joining me once again. And if you want any in, in video, tell me on tell me in the comments what video should I do next. DM me what video should I do next. Should I hurt a rooster? Maybe. So guys, guys, good night. Goodbye. Thanks for everything. Bang.